Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in Photoshop CC. Today we're going to play with fire. I'm going to show you how to light this candle in Photoshop. What you want to do is create a new blank layer above the photo image. And this photo comes from unsplash.com. So come over here to the toolbar, grab the pen tool, or just simply click the letter P. Now you need to have a work path in order for this effect to work. So we're just going to draw a little a straight little line using the pen tool. Real easy. There's no real rhyme or reason to this. Just make a little line, just a little curved line, just like that. Come up to filter. Go to render, and we're going to go to flame. Now here you have some different options. There's several different flames, but we're going to keep this on candlelight. And just like that, we have a pretty cool looking flame. There are some advanced settings here. If you want to play with some of these, the turbulence, jag, opacity, there's different flame styles, random shapes, but we're going to keep it as the default just so you can see the effect. And just like that, we have a flame. Now you can see this path layer here. You don't need it anymore. So just hit delete a couple times to get rid of the path. Oops. One too many, undo that to get rid of it. So just like that, we have a pretty realistic looking flame. So this is on its own layer, which is pretty cool. So you can actually transform it. You can move it around, change its shape, or you can add a layer style to make it look a little bit more realistic. So I just double clicked on the layer to add a layer style. I'm gonna go to outer, outer glow. And just like that, I have a pretty realistic looking flame in Photoshop in a matter of no time. So there's lots of things you can do with that flame. You can actually create some realistic fire effects just like that. So play around with it, filter, Render, flame. You just need a path in order for this to work. Cheers.